it's my goal, whether I was coaching in high school or coaching the USA women, to try to uh, give lots of freedom to our players in competition to play the game, to see, to make decisions, to respond accordingly. I don't want them looking over at me after every play, between every play. So if you see the way I coach, it's, um, I, I like to step back because I cannot make the real-time decisions for them. They have to do it. They are the ones who have to play the game and figure it out. And I feel like I'm just going to get in the way with constant chatter, constant corrections, especially technical things. I'll certainly get them back on track if we're not executing what we were supposed to in the scouting report. We were supposed to take a line on this hit or we're taking an angle. Yeah, we'll make that correction. But it's much less about um, chipping away at every mistake. And it's more about mistakes will happen. Randomness will happen. Chaos will happen. That's real volleyball. It's going to look ugly sometimes. So uh, the best thing we can do is get back to who we are with a firm response, um, a focus on a, on a simple thing, and all of our players uh, train themselves in doing that. They don't need a lot of help from coaches in that department. And so it's our job at every level as coaches to try to empower our players to become thinking, seeing, responding players who don't have to depend on constant outside feedback and correction.